Welcome back to Big Island Living. My name's Blake Cousins, and today we're on the Kona Coast with the original Captain Zodiac, rafting and dolphin adventure, voted best tour in Kona. So join us as we discover sea caves, lava tubes, blowholes, and view amazing wildlife above and below the water. So hold on tight, because we're with the true pirates of Captain Zodiac on the Kailua coast. Aloha, and welcome back to another episode of Big Island Living. My name is Blake Cousins, and we're on the Kona coast, and it's going to be an amazing day today. Good morning, welcome to Captain Zodiac Rafting Adventures. Today we're gonna board the boat right here at the helm. Come on aboard, young man. Yeah. One, two, three. Captain oh Mike here is boarding up the crew. And for being a pirate, this welcome guy welcome is aboard. super Aloha, cool. Aloha, guys. Good morning. Come on, little one. Big step, big step all the way up, down in. Aloha, aloha. All right, we're all on board. You guys ready to rock? Yeah! Absolutely beautiful out. Blue skies. We got a 14 mile run down to Kealikekua Bay for the best snorkeling in all of Hawaii. All right, Mike, so what kind of speeds do we get on this boat? Uh, we're going to be running at about, about 25, 30 miles an hour across the water out here. It moves pretty fast. It's a very smooth, safe ride out here on the ocean. So talk about safety. With those kind of speeds, man, I'm kind of getting a little pumped up on this. Uh, for safety on board our boat, we have a couple of extra uh, additional features. The most important one for everybody is that rope down by your feet, guys. You all see that? We all don't right. have seat belts. Those are called feet belts. You definitely, you guys hold on when we pick up speed here. We're going to pick up the speed. You guys all ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. Here we go. Hey, tell me, Mike, what kind of dolphins are these? These are Hawaiian spinner dolphins. Uh, spinner dolphins are found throughout tropical regions of the world, but these guys don't migrate anywhere. They're their own subspecies, and they live right here along the Kona Coast. If you're looking for an adventurous tour of a lifetime memory, then the Captain Zodiac is for you. They're the original rafting expedition in Hawaii and have been entertaining visitors for the last 38 years. They are not just water transporting to a snorkel destination. They are an entire experience. Their logo is skull and crossbones. And make no mistake about it, they are pirates through and through. We've been pillaging and plundering the Kailua coastline for decades and have a blast doing it. Captain Zodiac operates intimate 16-passenger military Zodiac Hurricanes, 733s, the exact vessel made by Zodiac of North America for U.S. Navy SEALs and U.S. Coast Guard. They are fast, powerful, highly maneuverable, and very safe. What an amazing ride. 300 horsepower makes you feel like you are in an action movie straight out of Hollywood. Now we're at this new location. We settle it down just a little bit, and Mike's gonna tell us about this unusual feature right here along the cliffs. All right, Mike, tell me about this blowhole that's about to happen. Whale spout, blow up. Oh, wow. That is amazing. One more, one more, guys. Now we're off to Kealakekua Bay with Captain Zodiac. The serenity of 
Keala Kakua Bay is absolutely stunning for the senses. This place is absolutely beautiful. Where are we? We're in Keala Kakua Bay, a marine sanctuary, Hawaii's premier and best snorkeling spot. You don't get any clearer water here in all of Hawaii than the Kona Coast. So tell me about this monument back here. What does it represent? This is Captain Cook's monument. This was the first place he landed in the islands of Hawaii. And that was uh, January 17th, 1779. This is where James Cook actually lost his life, right behind me? Uh, he lost his life on Valentine's Day, 1779, the hands of uh, a dispute with some natives here, right in Keale Kikua Bay. All right, guys, well, the water looks clear. Are you guys ready to go dive in? Yeah. Woo! It's the pirate on the high seas, and these girls and guys are about to walk the plank. You're out of here. Go for it. We'll see ya. Wow, these guys are getting down, and we're going to join them right here. I saw parrotfish, I saw butterflyfish, I saw fish. I don't even know what they are, but they're awesome. <laughs> Isn't it clear? It's so clear. I can see eels all the way down to the bottom. It's just so clear. I can't wait to keep snorkeling. It's an amazing day here at Kalakakua Bay, and you know, I don't I didn't bring my swim trunks. Whoa! The original Captain Zodiac is a place to be if you're gonna explore these exclusive locations in Kalakakua Bay. The water is so clean you can see forever. Being down here is like being on another planet. Captain Zodiac will provide masks and snorkel and instruction if you have never snorkeled before. And to explore this amazing location is like a dream come true. Swimming down here makes me think about the past and the ancient Hawaiians and how they actually swam and fished here for thousands of years. You know what, I think I'm just gonna stay down here for a while. I've explored and dived all over the state of Hawaii and let me tell you, this is one of the best experiences I've had down underwater. What happens next for me is a once in a lifetime experience. I got to swim with spinner dolphins. These magnificent creatures glide through the water as if they were superheroes flying through space. This is my highlight of the Captain Zodiac experience. Wow, that was awesome down there in the water, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. It's been awesome. Awesome. <laughs> All right, the captain set us up with a little meal. They got cookies, chips, and even some pineapple and oranges. Let's dig in, guys. <laughs> Kicking back and eating some grub, it really made me feel like I was a pirate. And hanging out with these bunch of great people, it was sure a lot of fun on Captain Zodiac. And the adventure has just begun. So how's everybody doing on the Captain Zodiac Revenge? <laughs> All right. I'm glad everybody's having fun on the Captain Zodiac. So Mike, tell me a little bit more about Captain Cook. Captain Cook landed here in uh, the middle of January, 1779. This bay is called Keale Kekua, which actually means the pathway of the gods. When he landed here, it was a very important time of year for the Hawaiians called Makahiki. They believed that he was their god Lono, the god of the Makahiki season. When he dropped his anchor in the middle of this bay, the largest reception for the Royal Navy took place. 5,000 Hawaiians came out to greet their god Lono. 
Well, it almost sets you right back in time, and it, it's hard to believe it actually went down here. How did he actually pass, and what was the big misunderstanding about his death? Well, when push came to shove, they finally realized that they were not immortal, that they were actually living men, mortal men, just like the Hawaiians. Uh, push came to shove after Captain Cook returned to this bay to rebuild his boat that had broke between here and Maui. And the Hawaiians basically wanted to barter for some things off of the boat that they couldn't. Well, that makes sense. You know, you know, they probably took a little bit advantage of the Hawaiian people in, the, in their own sense, being that they're a little vulnerable in, the, in that time of history, right? Absolutely, absolutely. One of Captain Cook's uh, rowboats went missing and he went to try to retrieve this boat in the early hours of February 14th, 1779. That was Valentine's Day. He took 10 Marines into the village of Kalavaloa, and actually, after a half hour of searching around the grounds, they couldn't find the boat. A little misunderstanding took place between him and the local chief here, which erupted into a small skirmish, and the end result was that Captain Cook was bludgeoned to death here that very morning. Well, when you come on the Captain Zodiac Adventures, they got the history, the story down. Tell me, where are we off to next? We're going to go run right along the shoreline and show you the beautiful topography of the Kona Coast. All right, guys, let's rock. Leaving Kealakekua Bay, really set me back in time with Mike's history telling of the ancient Hawaiians and the arrival of Captain Cook. So Mike's got something else in store for us and I can't wait because the adventure still continues. All right, don't go away. We'll be right back with more Big Island Living with Captain Zodiac. Hold on tight, because we're back with Big Island Living and the adventures of Captain Zodiac. On the return trip, it's when you see something awesome and fascinating and the signature part of the Zodiac tour. We get in close and hug the rugged coastline and explore places that only these powerful zodiacs get into. Hey Mike, this is like being in a cathedral in here. Tell me about this cave right here. Uh, a couple of the dive operators, they refer to this as the amphitheater. We call it the grotto. At one point in time, this had a massive roof way above our heads and it actually imploded due to a huge earthquake. Hey, check it out guys, that's an ocean waterfall and it only happens when the swells are up. Hey Mike, these caves are really awesome. So where are we off to next? We're gonna run around the point here and we're gonna go show you a really cool spot called Red Hill. The Red Hill, here we go. Come on, punch it, Bishop. Definitely could understand why the Coast Guard would be using these Zodiacs. They absolutely gun it right over the water. We're off to the most revered impressions in all of Hawaii. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more Big Island Living. We're cruising on the rugged coastline of Kona with Captain Zodiac, and this is an amazing adventure. I'm glad you guys are back with us on Big Eye Living. Wow, Mike, so this is called Red Hill. Why do they call it Red Hill? Red Hill for all of that iron oxide that was trapped in this lava. This is also a home to the god of the volcano. Her name's Madame Pele, the most revered impression found throughout all of Hawaii, left here embedded upon the cliff. Whoa, do you guys see that? There's a face on the wall. You see the two eyes and the mouth? The lower face over here, known as a lele. This was a sacrificial altar in the old Hawaiian times. You mean this has been sacrificial grounds right here? Absolutely, right here before us. If we were caught here hundreds of years ago, we'd be put to death ourselves. Oh my God. Have you ever been this close to dolphins before? No, never. This is the first time. Right beside us, right on the side of the boat. It's great. This is so awesome. 
Yeah! I'm telling you, the original Captain Zodiac is the best adventure right here. You know, this is really cool. Hold on, here we go. These pirates sure know how to have fun, and I know everybody on board is too. Everybody, hold on, we're going for it. Driving back in Honokahau Harbor made me feel like it was the adventure of a lifetime with Captain Zodiac. Hey Mike, I really want to thank you. You did an awesome job being the captain today. Excellent. Did you guys all have fun? Yeah! Awesome. And thank you, Big Island Living. This guy knows how to rip it up, big time. Aloha! All right, we made it safe and sound back to the harbor. It was a blast. If you're looking for the best action ocean adventure, you check out Captain Zodiac, right guys? <laughs> All right, I'm Blake Cousins, and we'll see you again at another episode of Big Island Living. All right, this is Bill, owner of Captain Zodiac. Wow, he helped us out in getting some of the amazing shots you saw today. Tell, tell me what, how long you've been driving this boat and you guys been in business yeah. at Captain Gosh, Zodiac? you know, it's amazing. We actually started the business back in 1974 over in Kauai. We opened this place in 1984, so we've been here 27 years doing this. I haven't been doing it all that long, maybe 26, but I've been having fun every day when we go out in the water. You guys saw a typical day of what we do. Lots of adventure, lots of marine life, beautiful snorkeling spot. Come on out and join us sometime. All right, Bill, these guys are the pirates of Kona for sure. And you definitely got to check out this adventure right here. Yes, amazing. Let's do it again, again, again. Snorkeling. Yeah, and dolphins. Really dolphins, yeah, the dolphins.